Welcome back to our YouTube channel. LA Live here guys. So we are actually right now at first temple in Bangkok, which we before never visit temple in Bangkok, just in the older places. And this one's supposed to be one of the most, uh, I think, famous and most interesting. Yeah. The name is Wat Arun. Wat Arun Temple. Yeah, and does. we are so excited to just uh, see around. Definitely diff looks different already than most temples we've seen. So yeah, we're gonna explore. So. So first of all, don't forget coverage. Like, as you can see, Linda's just wearing long pants, and she actually has a vest underneath it. Yeah, like she and has you a cannot vest. have it. Yeah, you, women cannot have a vest, so she just has like a little cardigan to, basically yeah, over her have, shoulders. Yeah, this is normally long. I just wrap it. I'm normal. I'm just t-shirt and shorts. And I think it's also not a fair thing because, like, if you have a vest, do you think they stop you? Yeah, if a man has a vest, you're not really like that. Yeah? You're not really supposed okay, to. Okay, but that's fine. T-shirt is fine. Same thing for a woman. If a woman has a t-shirt, you're fine. Linda has a vest. That's why she had to put a cardigan over because her shoulders are showing. But yeah, guys, don't forget to bring covering. And uh, we paid 100 baht each to get into this temple. So 200 baht all together. So you're not allowed to touch. So why are you touching that for all? You're not really why are we? <laughs> we are like this. You're not really, no, this is fine. Like. I feel like this temple is the most detailed temple ever we seen. Like. So guys, the construction began in 1847. Wow! 1847. Wow. That's a long. Uh, the good spot, and we watch the uh, watch this temple. Look, you have a stairs, literally very, very steep, very steep. You cannot, you can you go even here? No, you cannot go here. This entrance. No. Okay. And look at this. Perfection. And guys, it's 82 meters tall, so it's 82 meters tall, and it was actually before they started building all the skyscrapers in Bangkok, all the businesses, all the office skyscrapers. This right? one was the tallest? Yeah, before the skyscrapers, this was the tallest building in Oh, Bangkok. that's very special. We've seen so many temples, like how many temples have you seen actually in, uh, in Thailand? About like five or something. No, more. See, you can come like this with this boat, which is pretty cool, right? I love it. I love it. This is actually really different part of Bangkok. Yeah. Really different looking part of Bangkok. Yeah, and all the skyscrapers are there behind. It's pretty nice. Wow, with the tallest building. Bangkok is like crazy, guys. So. Just before, if you decide to rent a bike, just know that it's got so, some of the traffic will be very crazy. Especially if you're on a motorbike and you're driving, like let's say 20, 30, 40 minutes, you'll have to take a road that said that on the GPS will be no toll. So you, that means you're not because you're not allowed to, on the bike to go on a highway on a motorway. So you're gonna have to drive a longer way, and sometimes it means that you get really stuck in big traffic. You know? Yeah. So we made a footy! Because we have been getting actually some really good feedback from you guys, you know, saying how much you appreciate the footage, the drone. How much footage. we've improved yeah, with how much our. We improved with the drone footage, so uh, yeah, it's a nice feeling to be able to give you not just obviously camera shots, but also drone shots, which is, of course. Armandes so is. Armand, uh, just letting you know, guys, Armandes is in charge of the all the drives around with the drone. Yeah. He's the old driver with the drone. I had to look at some YouTube videos, you know, to learn how to really take more like professional looking shots. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy them. Yeah, we're learning. So sorry guys for if I move so fast with camera because we got also feedback like that. <laughs> yeah, guys, we've seen these guys back in Koh Samui. They're very cool 
looking soldiers. They look like they're soldiers anyway. <laughs> yeah, they're very cool. I need to hold you, need to touch you right. I miss the way we were before. And everybody knows. And everybody knows you too. And everybody sees. We got one of our favorite foods to actually eat in Thailand, which is gyozas. And they were so Ooh, big. They're huge. They, yeah, they're so big. It's usually they're like almost half the size. It's pork? Of yeah. We love pork. It's pork. Gyoza. But they're almost half of the size that normally. I was yeah. like, wow, they're so big. So let's see. Okay. We have people singing, we got the fishes in the water, huh. everyone's happy making a living. Yeah. Guys, we made it to Floden Market. So we wanted an interesting day uh, of recording like a proper mini vlog. So first we went to Bat Arun as you see and now we are uh, in Floden Market. There's so many markets, food, clothing, uh, souvenirs. Beautiful, and we are sitting beside water where there's fishes inside. And the gyoza is a huge, huge, and actually very yummy. It's just very hot <laughs> because you deep frying them. So good. drink in the entire Thailand for me. I was getting back in Phuket and Krabi non-stop uh, Thai tea for like lunch but I have to come down you know <laughs> and now it's so precious. So good. Oh so good right? Give me life. Oh. I, if I can describe how I feel, I feel like again I was reborn. <laughs> Amazing Sunday. Yeah. Too good, right? Life. It's very good atmosphere, music and karaoke, right? Karaoke people singing. So I hope that Armand will decide to go sing as well some, maybe some English song <laughs> in the Donald Thai. Because we are actually liking Thai. Oh my goodness, okay. start singing Christmas songs. <laughs> it's coming to Christmas. Get everyone prepared for Christmas. You know? We bought presents on yeah, this floating right. market. We got presents for our nephew and niece. <laughs> bought him some like a remote control uh, like excavator. You know excavator that digs the, the It's called like that? Construction. Yeah, and it's excavator, so one of them. And um, our niece loves it, uh, well, she loves princesses and she loves Lego. So we bought her like a little like building with some princess, yeah, like, like a princess Lego set. So yeah. yeah.